Alston prepares to demolish Hillcrest Landing, a small strip mall just a block up the road from the historic downtown district. The city is also planning for its next round of redevelopment in the area. And tonight, our Marlo Lundak shows us where the future changes will happen. Part of the Ralston community is getting ready for a transformation. The idea is to replace an aging industrial area with residential and commercial life, similar to some of the other areas you see in the community, uh, Benson, Blackstone. Rick Hoppy is the city administrator. Six News asked him about the new Hinge 72 project. We have about 10 acres of prime redevelopment land in the middle of the Omaha Metro along 72nd Street. The city recently acquired two industrial properties at the corner of 72nd and Main Streets. They've put out a request for proposals for developers to come transform the land, an opportunity that Hoppy says doesn't happen often. Ralston is landlocked. We can't grow out. Um, we're surrounded on all sides by the city of Omaha on three sides and Sarpy County on the other. The only direction we can grow is up. So when we have land in the core of the community that can be redeveloped and we bring economic development to the community that we otherwise couldn't get because we can't grow outward. The land will be transformed into commercial, residential, park and entertainment space. It's all in an effort to better connect Ralston's downtown with 72nd Street and the Liberty First Credit Union Arena. We couldn't be more excited. You know, we are entrepreneurs and for entrepreneurs, it's all about momentum. The team who owns and operates the granary, which is also part of Ralston's greater redevelopment plan and is just a stone's throw away from the future Hinge 72 development, says the upcoming changes will be good for business and the community. The traffic count is very, very high along this portion of 72nd Street. And if we have just a portion of that traffic have a reason to pull into the Hinge, um, it could make a significant difference in the economy for all parts of Ralston. On your site in Ralston, Marlo Lundak, 6 News. City of Ralston doesn't expect demolition and construction on the new project to begin for about two more years. Right now, they're still in the process of receiving proposals and choosing a developer.